Hey guys, Chris Grant here with ClearTheShelf.com and today I'm going to show you how to set up your MWS keys with uh, Amazon and Tactical Arbitrage. This is going to be the first video in a series of videos that walk you through all the features of Tactical Arbitrage. Now, the first place that you're going to want to start is in the FAQ section of Tactical Arbitrage. and this first setting up the MWS keys that's exactly what you want to have up here and that will pull up this PDF and it walks you through everything okay uh, and you're going to want to leave this up as well so that you can have the the fields that you're going to need to copy and paste so we right click or double click if you are a Mac user <clears throat> on the link that's in the PDF and then I always open it up in a new tab. This is going to take us to the developer, uh, uh, the market or Amazon Marketplace web service, and you're going to want to hit sign up for MWS. Now I'm already logged in. Uh, it may ask you to log in, which you may need to do, but you can see here that I am already good to go. And you're going to want to click on the second radio button that says you want to use an application to access your seller account with MWS. Now, this does not give Tactical Arbitrage your uh, account information. What it does is it allows Tactical Arbitrage to run calls to the API so that they can pull back price information as well as ranks and things like that. So you're not going to have to worry about uh, anybody at Tactical Arbitrage being able to see all the things in your account. Uh, in the application name, you're going to want to type in Tactical Arbitrage. And then in the application developer account number, you're going to want to come over here and you can see that it's 9127. What I do is I actually copy this and you want to take it back over here and I paste it and then you're going to want to knock out those dashes. Click on next. And on this page, you're going to want to agree that you understand to the Amazon Terms of Service for another third party using your account. Click on Next. That will take you to the this screen where you actually have your seller ID, your marketplace IDs, and your MWF authorization token. Now I have blurred mine out so that you guys can't see them, but what you're going to want to do is you're going to want to have the seller ID and the MWS authorization token available. You'll come back over to Tactical Arbitrage and go into Settings. And the first thing you're going to want to do is copy the seller ID and place it right up here where it says US slash CA NWS seller ID. Just paste it right in there. I've blurred mine out again. Come back to the other tab, and you're going to want to copy and paste or copy your MWS authorization token. Say that ten times fast, and then you're going to want to put that in MWS authorization token right down here. And then you scroll down to the bottom and you click the save button. That will set it up so that you're ready to use tactical arbitrage and in our next video we'll get into the product search and all of these filters and things like that uh, as well as some tips as to how I use tactical arbitrage when I'm looking for product. If you have any questions make sure to uh, leave a comment on the blog at cleartheshelf.com leave a comment here on the YouTube video and I'll be more than happy to get back to everybody and uh, even make more videos if that's what you need. So I hope this helps and appreciate you watching. Have a great day.